Hi everybody, welcome to This Week in FMP Youth News, I'm J.E. Bundy. This week on Sunday morning we'll be continuing our series, Subject to Change. We'll be talking about how we as junior high and high school students deal with all of the immense amounts of change that we are dealing with on a daily basis. All the things that are going on in our lives and in our families and in our friends. And how do we deal with that? How, what do we hold on to when life gets rocky and shaky? And last Sunday we talked about how even when life changes, God does not. That God remains the same. And the same God that took care of us in the past is the same God who will take care of us right now, who is taking care of us right now, and will continue to take care of us in the future. And so it's been a great study so far. I've really enjoyed our, our, our first lesson and our first small group discussion about it. And I'm looking forward to, to doing the same thing this Sunday morning and Wednesday nights in our small group. And so uh, come and be a part of those things. If you haven't already, I, I know you'll be blessed by being a part of all of those things that we're doing. Coming up, October 14th is date night. And so if you have not signed up yet, there's still plenty of time to do that. Please talk to Russell Winkley on Sunday morning. He'll have the sign-up sheet and let him know you want to do it. He'll partner you up with one of our senior saints. And it's an awesome opportunity for you guys to get to learn some of the wisdom from people who have lived life beyond what you can see. Uh, for you to be able to hear their stories, hear about what it's like growing up in a different time, in a different era, and, and how the world has changed and, and the change that they have seen. Uh, it's a blessing for you and it's a blessing for them to be able to spend time with young people. And uh, it means a lot to have a young person sit across the table from them and to sit and to ask questions and to listen to their stories. And you can be a huge blessing in their life. Uh, so please sign up for that if you have not already. I promise uh, you'll enjoy it. That's a, that's a great experience. Uh, on into the future, on October the 18th, we're starting our senior high Bible study at our house. That's going to be from 7.45 to 8.45 p.m. every Thursday night from the 15th of October to, excuse me, from the 18th of October to the 15th of November. And so I hope everyone can make it to that. It's going to be a great study, Love First, looking at how we can love the world the way that God loves the world. And I can't wait to, to go through that with y'all and, and hear your thoughts about all that. Uh, and into November, uh, just so you can be planning ahead, we have Encounter LE and we have the West Texas Girls Conference coming up. And both of those are just one weekend apart, so I know November can get crazy, but I hope that you'll make every effort you can to, to try to sign up and be a part of those. These are great events, not just for you as individuals, but for our group to, to grow closer together, to share some experiences and to bond. And, uh, and I love taking you guys on, this group, on, on these trips. So please sign up for those. Uh, those are coming up in November. Also into January, we have Winterfest. And we have sign-up sheets right here on this wall. And so you might have noticed over the last couple of weeks that, uh, that this wall has been morphing and changing and adapting. And we've been adding all new ways to, to get information into your heads as we can. So if, if you're wondering what's going on in the youth ministry, here it is. And here's the ways to find it. We have links to all of our social media. We have daily devotionals that go along with our series. We have calendars that you can pick up. You can hang on your refrigerator at home. Uh, information about it. Lots of events that are coming up. This is all. This TV is always scrolling with uh, announcements and, and information about things coming up. So this is a great place to start looking for information, and it will take you to places where you can find more information, like our website and our social media and things like that. And as always, if there's any other questions that you have, you can always give me a call, shoot, shoot me an email, or stop by the office. I'm happy to sit down, have a cup of coffee with you, and talk about all the things that are coming up because I'm really excited about all of the opportunities that our teams are going to have in the next couple of weeks and months to grow closer to each other and grow closer to God. And that's what we do here at FMPU. So thank you very much for tuning in and listening, watching this video. I appreciate your time. I really do. Uh, that's this week in FMPU Youth News. I hope you have a great week. Bye-bye.